knows precisely what you require of her. You never have to go to the producer and say, she hasn't got that right. I've never had to say that about Molly, not on any occasion. Throughout 10 years and over 100 scripts, I don't remember having to say to the producer, she hasn't quite got that right. And, you know, that is some accolade. We did an update of The Liver Birds, and she was quite poorly when we did that. She was on quite heavy medication. She wasn't well at all. Never lost her sense of fun. Never missed a cue. Why should I worry? I've still got the menopause to look forward to. Well, of course, that's up to you. I never allowed it myself. <laughs> you see, Sandra, I've always tried to be refined. Yes, you have, Mummy. Even when I was being mugged, did I scream and shout? Now, did I? No, Mummy, you didn't. I bet his round bits are still tingling. <laughs> And that's Molly for you. She's, she's got those basic ingredients which all the really funny people have got. They've got the bedded technique. They've got... They'd never let you down. I don't think Molly ever forgot a line in the 11 years I worked with her. I don't think she ever did. Never lost a laugh, never lost a line. Did you hear that? <laughs> it was your daughter. <laughs> she says she's tired of being nice. Well, I suppose she had to catch up with you sometime. I mean, you were never nice. You were born not nice. A fortnight late you were, and even then you didn't have the decency to come the right way. <laughs> Feet first, kicking the world in the teeth. You demolished four cots before you were a year old. <laughs> oh, my daughter. My own daughter talking to me like that. <laughs> It'll be a long time before I fold her again. Hello? I'm just saying it'll be a long time before I fold her again. Comedy.